So, lumata, laki po pumuni yan na nakapasok po. Tapos po, na ano, pinadyakan siya, tapos nag-slide, tapos nabali ang kamay. Nabali ang kamay niya. This is multiple fracture we're talking about. Kasi pagka, pagka ano sa kanya, sinuntok siya sa kamay, pagka subsub niya, tapos nilagyakan siya. Hindi po daw sila binigyan ng lawyers, ma'am. Hindi po sila binasahan ng Miranda rights nila. Parang sabi ko, wala pong proper procedure sa paghandle ng trans woman. Hanggang ngayon po, nanginginig ako kapag naiisip ko pa rin po yun. Dahil feeling ko po, napaka-violent nila. Together with the Human Rights Affairs Office of the Philippine National Police, Outright Action International conducted several workshops with police officers in police precincts in Metro Manila and regional trainings for police trainers on human rights to sensitize them to the human rights of LGBT persons. Pinaking kanila ko ano yung story ko, ko ano po yung nangyari sa akin. Para hindi po sila naging judgmental na yun. Ang sarap pala ng pakiramdam na pantay yung pagtrato. Ang sarap yung respeto sa mga polis. Naibabahagi ko yung, yung guidebook ng PNP, based policy, para maalaman nila yung karapatan din ng LGBT. Uh, kung paano pakiharapan yung members ng LGBT, whether you are the complainant or victim, na ibigay yung nararapat na karapatan nila. To serve and protect. That is the motto of the Philippine National Police. And hopefully through our engagements, dialogue, and workshops with them, to serve and protect will also include LGBT persons in the Philippines. We look forward to that day when police officers are seen as allies. <laughs>